Now, generally speaking, I tried to avoid original dub line jokes um, in all my stuff, really, because uh, I think it's kind of lazy, but Gantz is just full of... the Gantz dub is just ridiculous, especially in, in the Buddha Saga. Honestly, I think that's around where the, the uh, translation, the dub writers, decided, you know what, fuck it, this show is ridiculous, and we're just going to have fun with it. <laughs> so it had all kinds of crazy shit like that in it, so I just couldn't resist. And I couldn't think of anything clever to do with it, so I just tossed that in there. Uh, a little Naruto music there. <laughs> this was a fun little scene to edit. Holy crap, boy's killing that giant statue all by himself. <laughs> How can he top that? I mean, what's his finishing move? <laughs> yeah, that weird... that was just weird. I don't know. I forget if they did that weird little shot in the manga, or if it was just... I mean, I don't want to interrupt if you need another couple minutes. Oh, oh, you are done? Oh, okay, good. Socialism Cyclone! I don't know why being socialist gives him Cyclone powers other than the fact that it's alliteration. Maybe alliteration gives you superpowers. Socialism Stump Stomp! Repeating the same tactic over and over proved less than effective? <laughs> My world is crumbling around me! This is for every asshole who ever beat me up in gym class! <laughs> you got beat up in gym class? Pussy. That scene was a bitch to edit. Hey, I think I may be forming so, an idea. Yeah, there you, there's what if that. we, you know, helped him with shooting? Okay, make sure <laughs> I think that's the last shot. time that problem. line there is the last Did time that Hojo, that I ever that I even Jesus, bothered to make day. him speak like an idiot, let alone Very actually shot. be an idiot. I think after that point, Where did that, come from? that shot I, I am so glad needed I something. I needed person. music or I something. I don't know. That was oh, messed yeah. up. It's definitely but over. um, but yeah, starting right here, I I just give up on Hojo being yes. anything like Zoolander, and from now on, he's wow, just none of us ever the smart ass guy. Really and I think he's way better for it. <laughs> Poor sniper guy. Only person with a brain in his head in literally this entire show. And he doesn't even last one arc. Is it over? Because something like that always happens. <laughs> that is one big Buddha. Yeah, it is. Oh, this this meet the Buddha, kill the Buddha line is one of those lines that I've had stashed away since just about the first episode. My girlfriend got kind of annoyed with me quoting it at her every three Ooh, more minutes, characters. actually. Is that my smoking hot homeroom teacher? Oh, there was a whole no, obnoxious good. subplot here that I cut out where she's characters. arguing with her boyfriend because he's married and it's... I like the idea that um, I, I thought of the giant Buddha as kind of like my opposite of the green onion alien from the beginning. Like, if there's any alien in this whole show that should have been smart... It's, you know, the frickin' Buddha. And so I thought it was pretty hilarious to make him an idiot instead. No! I am not having my <laughs> falling in love montage to a cover! Now, uh, Vegeta3986 gave me no end of shit for this joke, because... Random trivia for the day. Vegeta3986 has a giant boner for the monkeys. And I don't understand why. It's a sad day for music. We're like the Beatles, only we don't play our own instruments and we suck! la di da I could kiss this suit if it didn't smell like ball sweat. Um, that was uh, Angel Elric as. What the hell's her name? Ring Girl. I know she has a name. I can't remember it. Okay, here's the plan. You guys without suits, try to. I don't know if anybody would have actually noticed if Cunnilingo was gone after this. But just in case, I kept that little thing in. Big enchilada is mine. It's cute that you want to show off, but it'll take all of us to take that thing down. Be reasonable. This it's been a while since we had a Gurren Lagan joke. Ah, there it possible. is! Because that's how I roll! What does that even mean? Who the hell do you think I am? The bad reputation <laughs> of the KKK has spread far and wide. And then there's this, <laughs> this bit where where Hojo is the only one who who knows who the head of, you know, the founder of the actual KKK was. <laughs> but he's supposed to be stupid. Okay, yeah, I I, I didn't really think that one. Do you actually believe any of that crap you just said, 
or are you just repeating something you saw on TV? Um... Okay, now I still think our best bet is to split... Honestly, the rest the of this episode I think was only so-so. I think it's well regarded just because of this bit, because this is pretty sweet. I barely did any editing here, actually. I, I just kind of tossed the song over the scene and it just worked. And, and actually, the one or two slightly rough patches in there, I was afraid to try to fix, because I was afraid I would fuck up the rest of it. Someone please tell me what just happened, because if I didn't know how crazy it sounds, I'd say Corono just jumped into that thing's head. Uh, I guess it's time to read his Yugugali. <laughs> okay, I guess I do call back to Yugugali. I don't know why I love the Yugugali so much. <laughs> you are getting so much ass when we get out of here. Poor Sakuraoka. Now this stinger coming up here, um, a lot of people seem to think that I actually edited all those eyeballs into the scene. <laughs> no, not not that talented. Um, <laughs> that's that's pretty much the raw footage. They kind of just ripped off Helsing there. But that's okay, because Helsing ripped that whole idea off from an Ozzy Osbourne album cover anyway, so it all evens out. <laughs> 